Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel, David Madison the Guardian. And thanks for stopping by this evening. Might even be morning by now. Um, so this serves as a platform for telekinesis and other tools for success. So in the last video, it was like 11 minutes. And I hadn't been getting hardly any, like, movement at all. And it's dead. Guys, it's completely dead here. There's no motion. So, I'm in the middle of a garage. And, uh... It took me a while, a while to build this up so that I could play with it. So when I first came in here, I couldn't, like, I could hardly move the back. And then I put the receipt and I, I hung it, like, over here. And then it fell down and it landed, like, right here. And so I started playing with it. Then it was here and I did this. So I had it on the ground. And then it started moving back and forth. And I was talking about what's called the one point. So the one point is about two to three um, fingers below the belly button. And you can pull and push from that area because the one point supposedly is also connected to the center of the universe and everything is connected to the center of the universe. Um, but you really experience that a lot more when you move from the one point. There's also a concept called um, keeping your weight underside. Both of these concepts, by the way, are in Aikido. Um, which was founded by Morie Yoshiba. Um, and it's, it's the, it's basically the way of universal harmony. It's a martial art, it's circular. It, a lot of it's like big circular motions. Whereas like something like Kali is much smaller motions. But, um, yeah, I just wanted to talk about that. I wanted to tell you guys that then all these energy systems, hey, kitty, kitty's coming over. He's like, what's this energy? He's like, let's explore this. I don't know which one this is. This might be Zeus or this might be uh, Poseidon. But he's just a, a fierce kitty, aren't you? Yeah? Nighttime, buddy, huh? I saw two cats earlier who were, uh, they were fighting, and it was so weird. Uh, he was like, is there any food? What's in that bag? What's in that bag? Uh-oh. I think there's another cat over there. It's interesting, right? Because when you begin to develop your intuition, you start looking at animal behavior. And I could only see one cat earlier today. But it was... It was being kind of weird. And uh, I saw it like coming out from the steps. From like, not there, but like way over there. And then, um, 
and I just noticed like it was it was walking slowly and the body was just weird what it was doing with its body it was just so strange and then it would look back over its shoulder a few times so I was like and I heard it like making this weird sound like something you know crazy like that and I thought because I had just got one watching uh, got done watching some Netflix on Netflix there's this guy William Shatner who was uh, you know Kirk on Star Trek and he's doing this docu-series called The Unexplained and it's a really cool series. He was talking about ghosts and stuff. The first, um, the first like episodes have to do with, um, there he is again. Kitty cat, kitty cat. Hey bud. Okay. All right, come on. Let's reset this. This blurriness. Come on. There we go. Alright. Yeah, okay, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, unexplained. So it was talking about like ghosts and stuff and like evil. So when I saw this cat. Um, looking back behind it, I was like, oh my god, is it seeing a ghost? Because you know how they say that animals, um, they can see in the, they might be able to see in the spectrums and stuff. Wow, this is going really great. I did not expect this to go this great. Nice pull. Yeah, I'm learning. I'm learning how to pull and push from this one point. I just sink the energy and then I drop and, and then I move it like in and out of my body until I find like the spot where it is. And then I hover around it. And of course, there's all those other things, right? There's the, uh, That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and share. And make sure you click on those bell notifications or the bell notification that turns black. And then uh, <clears throat> that way you'll be able to get any new videos that come out on my channel. And also, if anybody replies or responds to your comments or whatever, you'll basically just be able to know about the discussions.